The winner of tonight's game is White Money. <laughs> You may now put on the emblem of power. Yeah, guys, it's HOH Games, and congratulations to the winner of today's uh, HOH Games. <laughs> and again, you know, the housemate are just 11. Guys, congratulations to the winner. Yes. Well guys, you're welcome to my channel and do not forget to hit the red subscribe button below and turn on your notification bell and comment your opinion on what you feel about this video. Big brother, I saved myself and my minutes cross. Please, there is a description, there is a link I dropped in my description. Please do well to watch it. That's my YouTube, that's my YouTube music channel. And this is my music that you are seeing there. Please watch it and subscribe. I beg you. Okay. Queen. Thank you, brother. Do you accept the role of deputy head of house? Yes, big brother. Now, you know, most of us will be saying, how are we 11 housemates? Maybe you're forgotten. Let me just refresh your memory on that one. We have White Money. We have yourself. We have Pedre. We have Saga. We have Nini. We have Eliko Rose. We have Emmanuel, Sasuke, Cross, Queen, and Angel. It's quite unfortunate that Sasuke is not being pictured. I mean, I just noticed that ever since they did that eviction. Even before the eviction went to, it's j that always make um, maybe call your day to capture how yes, but I just I'm so so sorry for Sasuke because the way she's behaving She'll just end up going home and again guys, of course, you know every HOH don't participate in the next one and Now we have the new HOH. So that is why I am saying Congratulations to the new HOH Head of Housewives Money Yes, big brother because it's not it, it's not even easy to have HOH by this time and truly it's kind of tense. So so guys please guys, this video I would love you to watch. <laughs> Mr. Polymath <laughs> How are you guys? Can I'm you hear good, me? I'm good, I'm good. And you? Yo, yo. <laughs> well done. You made your mark on the show. Well done. Um so I'm going to dive right into the questions. My first question for you is, why did you decide to go into Big Brother House considering like your persona? You know, we saw you on the show and then we could figure out the kind of person that you were. You know, this is a reserved person. This is very, is an intelligentsia. Let me use that word. And you know, most times when you have people like this, they're very reserved. They're very in their own zone, in their own space. But she decided to be on a show where, you know, we needed to see you all out. So why Big Brother Ninja? Why that show? Okay, so basically, um, you know, that persona that, you know, people that are, um, like, have, like, are intelligent or see things or talk about intellectual stuff are more uh, reserved and all. I think it's not really true for me, uh, but, like, that I went to the, to the show. I've always been myself and all. I went into the show with the idea that okay, I'm 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 just jovial guy too. I talk about random stuff and all that. So that was the idea of me like going into the show. And then when I um like a period like after the first four days in the show, um, I you know because of the whole wild card thing, everybody was trying to read people very fast. And then like um, people just felt like okay, this guy is. You know, this guy just no book. Me, he shouldn't talk about stuff that we are talking about. So when I then start talking about those stuff, they feel like I am trying too hard, and they just put me into a particular place, and that made me feel somehow because I, I know I felt the way I used to, what I used to struggle with when I was like in secondary school, and also and all those things came to me, and I felt a little bit withdrawn, and uh, that was the reason why. 
um, I was a little bit quiet during that particular period. I think the last the few days leading to the nomination, um, nomination. I was a little bit quiet. But then I got myself back. You know, I got myself back. But then uh, it's just too late. Yeah, it's just too late. Yeah. So what do you think you could have done differently on the show? Um, just not let people get to me or. You know, it's just a part of me that I haven't really noticed. And that's why I say, you know, that the show really made me realize or know more about that part. But, like, it's just a part of me that I didn't really take note of. But at the same time, you know, I was being me. And and that's something that I can't change or I can't stop being. So, <laughs> so like, you know, basically, that was what I did. And, you know, that happened. And I was going through it. But, unfortunately, before that, the wildcard stuff, you know, I got nominated. And, yeah. That was it for me. All right. So in the house, you mentioned that you like liquor rolls. Um, is this something you intend to, you know, pursue outside of the house? Like when she comes out, you know, you want to pursue it with her. Um, for liquor rolls, um, she's an amazing person. And when I even went to tell her that I like her, um, she said, you know, earrings, I'll, I'll, you'll be my friend forever. And that was what she told me. And, you know, the next day, after I told her I like her and all that, you know, I, re I just decided that this girl will be an amazing friend. You know, we have lots of things we talk about and amazing stuff. So, like, I want to be friends with this girl. I don't know about relationships and all. It's not something that I want to push. I think it should come naturally if it comes. If it doesn't come, I'm, it's not like I, I'm telling myself that if Ligoros come out from the house, I'll do everything to get her. Nah, I'm not doing that. She's an amazing friend. I want to talk good things about her. I want to have good conversations with her. But like for the relationship, it will it will come naturally if it will, if it does, or if it has to come naturally. So that's that's it for me. Um, now that you're out of the house, like they've said so many good things about you. Um, most of the housemates have said that they miss you, they miss your presence. Now I'm wondering why they didn't say it when you were around, when you were in the house, because I know that even you know they. They had made you feel more um, welcomed or more relaxed in the house. You probably will not be out now. But um, which of these housemates would you miss the most? Um, I'll miss white money. <laughs> I'll miss my money. Just white money? Um, I'll miss Why would you miss I'll him? I'll miss Angel. I'll miss Jackie B. I'll miss Liquor Rose. I'll miss Sammy. Oh my God, I'll miss them so, so much. Oh my God. Like, so much. So much. Yeah. Um, how do you feel knowing that you know Perry and Maria put you up for nomination? You know, for for Maria, you know, she had a little I don't know, maybe a perception about me or something happened, an incident, and you know, she just, you know, always had me in her mind. You know, I, like few days ago I went on TikTok and I saw my name and then like I saw Maria speaking to like three people, four people that, you know, something happened. And she didn't even come tell. Is this something you would like to speak about? Yeah, is yeah, this something you would like to clear that. right now? Because in the house, she had mentioned that she was taking a bath, and then you were there, but she didn't. You know, like you were looking at her. You didn't try to take off your eyes off of her taking a bath. You know, is what what, what happened exactly? Because we didn't see it. We only heard what she said. Yeah, I think you know. I think, you know, that all, when she said it, like when I watched the video, you know, first of all, I wasn't aware of that and I didn't even see her naked or all that. I definitely didn't. But then, like, I understand she saying, I said Maria, Maria, because I remember saying that like three, four times whenever I see her and all that. Thank you very much for watching and don't forget to hit the red subscribe button below and turn on your notification bell and comment your opinion on what you feel about this video. Who were you thinking that would have won the hate to hate games? Guys, who exactly do you think would have won it? Just go to the comment section and drop it there, okay? And guys, please don't forget to subscribe, turn on your notification bell, and comment your opinion on what you feel about this video. And follow me on my social media handles at Jolly Choco. And please don't forget to watch that. My music I dropped on my description and sometimes on my comment section. 
please and subscribe okay i love you remain your humble doll you call your musician and i'll keep dropping your updates here and i will keep dropping my music on that's my channel so what you have to do is to subscribe the boat and turn on your notification bell the boat okay thank you comment your opinion love you stay tuned